World War II, the most bloodiest and murderous war in history of mankind. But to me, what shocked me the most was the war at sea. During the war, there have been huge losses of life on a single ship. Soldiers, civilians, and prisoners of war were the main victims. Here is one of the ships that shocked me a lot and that I'm going to present to you. The ship's name is Tamatsu Maru. This ship was laid down at Mitsui Shipbuilding in 1942 and was requisitioned by the IJA during its construction and was launched on the 18th of August 1943 but was completed in January 1944. Tamatsu Maru made several journeys in several convoys transporting troops and ammunition. One day, on the 8th of August 1944, Tamatsu Maru departed from Pusan carrying a Japanese regiment from Korea for defence of the Philippines. By August 1944, the Philippines were going to be attacked by the Allies, so the Japanese needed supplies and reinforcements. Tamatsu Maru joined convoy HI-71, a convoy which reinforcements for defence of the Philippines. Convoy HI-71 departed on the 17th of August and was discovered by the American submarine USS Redfish. The submarine Redfish assembled other submarines. They were going to do a wolf pack attack and they did a lot of damage. As the convoy was scattered by heavy seas and evasive manoeuvres, Tamatsu Maru got separated from convoy escorts and was spotted by the submarine Spadefish. The submarine fired six torpedoes and two of them hit the ship. The ship sank and 4,890 soldiers and crewmen were killed. The sinking of Tamatsu Maru was one of the worst losses of life during World War II. Here is a list of ships with great loss of life that shocked me. The losses of life are really high. 